Fleming's Man Cave here, and uh, today we're doing uh, uh, composite shapes, which sounds a lot harder than what it really is. Okay, you need to know a the areas of the different shapes that you're dealing with. Some will be circles, some will be semicircles, some will be rectangles, etc. You're either going to add them together or you're going to subtract. If you're missing that shape, you'll subtract. If you have two shapes added together, you're just going to simply find the total at the end. I'm going to do number one on page 660 if you guys want to follow along. It's a combination of a triangle and a rectangle. Got the two base formulas for those with me here today. And if you need to look them up, look them up. Don't be ashamed to do that. If you look at the rectangle, let's start with that. We know a base and height, 3.6 times 9.2. And that area comes out to be 3.6 times 9.2 times 3.6 times 9.2 times 3.6 times 9.2 times 3.6 times 9.2 times 9.2 equals 33.12 units squared. Okay, so just put that off to the side for now. Now the triangle is a little bit trickier because you do have to do some thinking. Um, we know the base is 9.2, so we can include that right away. We don't know the height. If you look at one side of the triangle, it says the whole thing is eight. And if you look at the opposite side, you know that one small portion is 3.6. So it's really easy. Take eight minus 3.6 and you've got the height of your triangle which is 4.4. When all this work is finished, so 1 half times 9.2 times 4.4 equals 20.24. So the area of the triangle is 20.24. These are the two numbers that you want, because now you have to add them together. So 33.12 plus 20.24 equals 53.36, but it says round to the nearest tenth, so 53.4 units squared. Now, you guys have seen these before presented to you. Um, usually they're in younger grades, they're presented to you as a challenge problem, but I don't think you're gonna have a problem. I'm only gonna give you six problems to try. So on page 661, six through 11, um, and if you have a problem, just shoot me a quick email, I'm right here for you. I miss you guys, hopefully you're doing well.